Hey guys, a quick update video today. The Polish-Israeli conflict enters its sixth day. We haven't lost yet, but the Israelis are mounting a fresh offensive. This is currently the front page of Haaretz. The article has some good insights on the issue. Netanyahu was allied to both Poland and Hungary since they all had some conflicts with the EU. Lapid, however, viewed the relationship with the Visegrad group worthless. He can score easy political points at home for what he calculates of low cost and differentiate himself from Netanyahu. I'll ignore the provocative title. Maybe I'll address it in a future video. But one phrase that came up in the article and comes up again and again in these articles is that Poland's new law is immoral. Remember our strategy, boys. We say no, it isn't immoral. And ask about Palestine. So, Mr. Befefer, is the absentee property law immoral? According to the Israeli custodian of absentee property, about 70% of Israeli land is absentee property that has uncompensated previous owners. Palestinians and their descendants have no right to argue in Israeli court for restitution of their property. Mr. Pfeffer, is this immoral? Another Haaretz article compares Poland's law to Israeli law. It's ludicrous to compare them. For 30 years, everyone, including the Israelis, were able to argue for case in court to get their property back if they can show ownership. Palestinians haven't had a single day. Mr. Pfeffer, would you even give the Palestinians the legal rights you are saying are so deeply immoral because of how restrictive they are? Would you allow Palestinians the legal right to legally argue for restitution of their property taken in the last 30 years, undoing three decades of expansion into the West Bank? If it's immoral to limit the restitution rights of Israelis to Polish land, is it immoral to limit the Palestinians' restitution rights to Israeli land. Could you please explain to us why one is immoral and the other is moral? Because to us, it just seems like you care about some people and not others. I would like to see an Israeli response to this question because everything I've seen so far online is pretty unbelievable. Do Virginia.